Hello everybody, I'm Raphael Perry and it's time for some more Kingdom Come Deliverance where we'll finally get to find out if this game breaking bug many people have reported will affect me. I hope it doesn't because that would be most unpleasant and most unfortunate. Come on loading screen. So many dead fucking bastards. Too right. So I found this hoof pick. Do you know anything about this hoof pick? Yeah. It's Ginger's. He had it made in Mate. Oh dear. Any idea where I might find this ginger? Well, that's the thing. He packed up and left. What? Look. I know how he looks, but Ginger is a fine fellow. I, I don't believe he For had a man to who's do with taken a time. nasty arm wound, that was one hell of a gesture. Really, just just one option each time. Where could he have fled to? I uh, I might know, but you gotta promise me one thing. When you find him, listen to what he has to say before judging. Well, I heard one of the bandits mention Miller Preshek or Peshek, and that's got me concerned because this could have an impact on Teresa as well, you know? You have my word. I mean, Sometimes unless he attacks me. Charcoal burners come to see him. He gets on well with them. I think that's where he's gone. And where is that? No idea. They've always kept to themselves, you know, charcoal burners. But the forest is full of folk like that. They could be anywhere. Aye, except these ones won't be far. If you follow the stream from the stud farm towards Rate, you'll come across one of their camps. Only... Uh-oh. Only what? Ginger didn't go that way, though. He always went by the big road, through the woods in the direction of Ujits. But how can I find them? There's always smoke when they work. <laughs> You'll smell them before you see them. Well, and they need to be near water. There's that too. So if I go through the woods along running water, I'll find them. Exactly. Oh, great. Ah, oh, great. Just brilliant. Okay, here we come. The moment of truth. Hey! Apparently this quest does not normally trigger for some people. Alright. That's a lot of horses. Where have all the guards disappeared to? And, uh... Horse. 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 Where's the dappled grey? This would be Henry's horse. Pebbles? Henry, you have no imagination. Or if you do, it's a rather feeble one. Do I see smoke? But apart from that, obviously. And the chimneys down that way. I mean, okay. Let's just jog back this way a little. There we go. Nope, that ain't gonna work. This fence is an obstacle, alright. I may regret this. Because if I scare the horses, they might hoof me one. And that's not pleasant. Probably shouldn't run then. What time is it? The hour is getting late. Very late. The guards have probably all just given up and gone to bed somewhere. So if he didn't go that way, 
I reckon he came up this way. That looks suspicious off to the right there. Just gonna check this all tallies up. So I reckon he come down through here somewhere. Been and gone and done a runner. That's not a good sign. So if he went out this way. Come down here, like this. Oh, that's not right. That music is very soothing. Nope, can't go this way, okay. Well, Henry. Uh, who's that? That looks like a guard to me. No, that looks like a more important guard. No, it's just a guard. There was me thinking it was uh, Bernard. Was it Captain Bernard? Captain Bernard, as they call him. I may have to light a torch soon. Easy there, Henry. Easy. You know, if we're going to be out looking in the forests of these fellows anyway, it might be worth checking those treasure maps before it gets too dark to do so. Um, okay, yep, yeah, not going to be there. He said he went towards Ushits, though. Okay, that ain't gonna be good. Okay, so not here. Um, it's that way. The windmill. I feel quite hungry. Nope, not gonna be this one either. Okay. And this one doesn't even have a place name on it. But there's deer, something else, near the deer. That looks like it could be Rote, but I'm not sure. Right. Yes, Henry, I don't doubt you are hungry. You will not eat that golden egg. Steady down the slope here, Henry. Right. Let's get a torch out. Because there's no way that could bring trouble or unwanted attention. Flipping heck. for charcoal burners in the forest near the waterways. Here. Yeah. There's a man with a torch. If he's hostile, I'll find out soon enough. No, no torch. Hello. 
I'm just going to not talk to you. Go about my armoured way. Careful not to set fire to the local foliage here. Bloody hell. Oh really? So quite near here then? It's no off. Right, I'm going to have to look into... Finding these treasure points soon. Really, activity giver. Well, if the main quest would actually let up and give me a bit of time to think. Oh, camp. Good. It's near here somewhere. No idea where, though. Aha! Are you all sleeping? Yep. Oh, spokesman, eh? Right, well. Um, Henry, this is what we're going to do. We're going to... Nope. Nope. Looks like they're busy burning charcoal here. Not a good place to try and sleep. Not very safe at all. Quite flammable, in fact. Actually... No, it's a long way back to... Farmer Pesh... Okay, Peshek, not Preshek. That's a good sign. Now, what's this? Interesting sight. Behind, yeah, 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 yeah. Still would like to go and learn to read at some point. Well, Henry, I think it's time for you to settle down. Just find somewhere Sit down like that. Okay. I, I was thinking, you know, facing the other way. Nope. Back to the path it is. Okay. Put that torch away. And get some rest. Oh, good God. Can but try. Dear game developers, that's not how you spell anorexic. There's an X in it. I think Henry's going to be eating some mushrooms this morning. Because he is bloody hungry. Actually, if only I'd s Oh my god, that's going bad. That's gonna... Yeah. Alright, that's better than nothing. Is there a cooking fire? There is! Magnificent. Henry, I need you to badly destroy some food. Um... Why, why can't I cook for rabbits? 
just meat. Okay, that's bad. I should relight their fire. So I just can't cook that at all. Okay. That is disturbing. Perhaps that's a skill Henry can learn in the near future. In the meantime, when are these fellows going to get up? There's another mushroom. That's not a mushroom, Henry. That's a log. Let's try again, shall we? This is a mushroom. Ah, that's right, Henry. You remember mushrooms? They're edible. Allegedly. You can even have a drink of this cheap wine. Okay, that's better than nothing. Now. Nope. I could do with a bite to eat. All right, Henry. Steady on now. I'll give it another a uh, couple couple of hours just to be on the safe side. You lot getting up yet? Yep. Yes, they are. Good, let's go pester them. Jesus Christ be praised. Indeed. Now, my name's Henry, and I'm not even important, but I'm going to pretend I am. Could you help me? Depends what you want, doesn't it? I'm looking for Ginger, a stable boy from Neuhof. They say he ran away and joined up with some charcoal burners he used to hang around with sometimes. Sorry, there's never been a lad called Ginger around here. You have to try somewhere else. Ooh. Um. You know, I'm gonna give it a try. A murder's been committed at Neuhof, and that boy likely knows who did it. It's vital I find him. There's been murder aplenty in these parts of late. But that ginger lad really Damn. hasn't been here. There'll be a lot less murdering going on once I bring those bastards to justice. So how about helping me out? Calm down, lad. For the oh. love of God. There's been no one like the boy you want round here. But then again, there are other charcoal burners. Try them. You might want to hurry. You're not the first to be asking about him. Oh dear. And the others weren't exactly a noble looking bunch. Although they were generous with their silver. They didn't happen to say what they wanted him for? No. But they definitely didn't look like they wanted to invite him to a feast. He looks very dry, doesn't he? Okay. Do you have any idea where else he could have gone? You said he was friends with the charcoal burners? Well, you'll definitely find some in the forest between Neuhof and Ujets. There's good spots around there. But that forest is huge. I could spend weeks searching. Then follow the river. That's how you found us, isn't it? Where there's charcoal burners, there's always water nearby. Thank you. Thank you. All right. I'll go and ask somewhere else. I feel quite hungry. Yeah, I bet you do. Now, on the plus side, Henry, if your search does take you all the way to Ujits, you might be able to learn to read while you've... well, at least learn. Like, A is an angel singing on high, B is a bear begging for biscuits, C is a... I can't remember, but it's a... it's not a crab, it's to do with being C-shaped. It might be a crab, actually. And you got, um... You know, T is a tree, the saddest tree I ever did see. L is a, something like, Linda likes to live in a lighthouse licking lollipops, or something like that for L. 
M is for value of a moon and sun meets at a dusk when the day is done. I can't remember all of these, but I can remember enough, right? So, bloody hell, Henry! You fell in the bloody water! Hey, fall in the water! <laughs> uh, the goon show again. That's just quite funny. Um, one of the commissioners, <laughs> when he saw the, uh, the, what was it? For the, for the, um, yeah, the proposition, the whatever, he asked, who are these go-ons, anyway? What do they do? It's like, it's like, actually, it's goons, sir. Oh, I see. Right. Easy, Henry, don't pass out. Keep following the water. Don't fall in the water, just follow it. So we're gonna... Oh, conciliation cross. So someone did something bad. Something very naughty. Oh, nest. Bird's nest. Where? Might be an egg in it. Well. There's no time, Henry. Oh, shit, Henry. You might end up having to fight someone. And you're well not ready for it. Man, the pace the main storyline is going at is just crippling. It prohibits any sort of sensible... Huh, nope, you fell in the bloody water again, you prat. Alright, I seem to be going a little much... A little too much to the east here. Yeah, I want to take the other branch of the river. So if I follow that up to here, that's not much use, is it? Unexplored place. Well, that's not very helpful. Right. Follow this little stream now. I'm not sure he necessarily meant this particular s stream here. Like, follow this river all the way up there. I think he just meant get the hell up there, then find a river and follow it. And Henry's running uphill, that's not healthy. Henry's got a horse. Henry hates horses. We've proved this. More importantly, horses hate Henry. And they hate him hard. Alright, alright, Henry. Come on. Run. Look, horses hate Henry, but this is important. It's so important that we're going to really mess it up. So if I ride the horse all the way up there... Hmm. And then find a place to drop it off. And then something bad happens. Yeah, I don't like this. I mean, whatever happened to don't stray too far and come back and report what you've found? And now the captain's not there to report to? Easy, Henry. Take a moment to get your breath back. Pebbles. Please don't be horrible to me, Pebbles. Oh, hey, there's... There's a guard. I can't even talk to you. Oh, you... At least she's not still out in the yacht. Here we are. Captain Bernard, sir. God be with you. I'm not going to ask for extra work. I'm not going to dob him in just yet. I'm going to go find out what's going on. Well, okay. I, I would have liked to be able to report earlier. Hmm. 
when he said don't go too far he has a, a very generous interpretation of what might constitute too far can I back up a little? I can good right now yeah kind of okay right easy all right easy Henry no 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 yes Henry come on pebbles don't be horrible to our poor Henry he's useless at riding horses I think here. No, 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 we can keep straight ahead. Ah! Yeah, alright, you, you can't gallop though, can you? Oh, you can, lovely. Nope, you're not galloping, you're just. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, easy, easy, easy. And we get a thunderstroke? Really now? This weather is not letting up for poor Henry, is it? Now. That looked a little ominous there. I thought I saw something in the distance. Hoping it's just agriculture. Those are the weirdest shaped hay bales I've ever seen. Easy now. We're getting remotely closer. Yes, we are. And there's water. Right. Okay, pebbles. We're going to be bringing you to a stop soon. Just not quite yet, though. All right. That's a bad sign. I think this tree. Oh God damn it, my stomach hurts. Yeah, all right, Henry. We've only got limited grub available. Look. And I mean, like, a load of it's going off and going really bad as well, you know? And you don't want to have that. You know what? Have a drink of water. Oh hell, that golden egg, right. And have some dried meat to go with it. A bit of bread. Some dried fruit. I didn't go through, did it? Bloody hell. Well, okay. Um, there's still blood on that sword, damn it. Hey, actually, horse. This could be getting dangerous. Already got padded choices on. No, I don't think there's anything there I want to use. Interestingly, this is not stolen anymore. Possibly because of my location. Well, okay. How's that vitality coming along, Henry? Terribly. What's this? Healing and healing. Okay, but he's not that injured. Why is Henry's main weapon not doing well? There we go. Oh! 62. 
two. That's a very good bow. Kind of bow that could get you in trouble if you get caught with it, though. Hopefully these charcoal burners won't notice the difference. Okay, so I'll be looking for these felled trees. Don't worry, rabbit, I'm not after you. Not this time. And we should remember that other bad people are looking for him. I bet he just, like, got into debt and thought no one would get hurt. Yeah, right in there, Henry, all the way to the camp. Good job. This is where we find out they don't know where he is either. We go to a third location. Ain't that right? Is it you? No, not you. Something tells me there'll be a spokesman. Yep. My respects to you. Hmm. I'm looking for Ginger from Neuhoff. Do you know anything about him? I know him. What do you want of him? There's a few questions I need to ask him. Well, he'll have to go somewhere else to find him. He doesn't come here much. Uh. Ooh. While that may have a slightly better chance, I'm going to go with this one. I really must speak with him. Be consistent. A murder was committed at the stud farm, and that boy probably knows who did it. I have to get him to talk. And you think he had a hand in it? Hard to say. He ran away, but on the other hand, it seems he stabbed one of the attackers. Well, you put it like that. <laughs> it's clearly urgent business. I do know him. Uh, not personally, but I've seen him around. He's friends with the charcoal. Oh, for God's sake. Townberg. I know he hangs around with the twins there. Downstream by Talmberg. Somewhere by the castle. If you follow the river to the west, you're bound to run into them. Oh, one more thing. Yes? Some other men have been yeah. around asking about him, but they weren't as uh, convincing as you. Yeah, sounds like a gang of fugs. Oh, Ginger. Well, it's going to be the Western Town but, uh, ones now, isn't it? Let's go back and find where Henry's put that horse. Am I going the wrong way? No, not necessarily. That's a good sign. Hooray! Memory is a magnificent thing. Hello, Pebbles. I'm so glad I found you. You make me feel like a slightly less useless prat. Yep, give the horse his head and let him go along the road. And we might just make it back into Talmberg. Maybe even sell off some of this junk. Or at least spend some money. Dro oh my god. Yeah, that's bad news. Better keep moving. Oh yeah, that's right. You gallop. Is there a shorter way back to Talmberg? Maybe a kind of sh no, not really. Not till I get to about here-ish. Okay. Yeah, you you puff at me, horse. See your mane just flapping out to the side there. Your fetlocks barely move though. All right, all right. Is there a no, 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 no. No. This way. Come on, horse. 
There we go. You know, this isn't so bad, just holding down the shift key and watching the horse trot along the road. Yeah, but Henry's not getting shot full of arrows at the moment. Then again, that could happen to poor Ginger if these other fellas find him first, and chances are they might. This ain't a good sign. Okay, 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 let's just ease up here a moment. Bloody hell. Okay, so pretty much straight ahead for a while. Okay. Wow. Well, there's a little bit of a I'm just not seeing that horse stamina move at all. This is uh, a much better steed than Elena, I must say. Um, yeah, about that, Henry. You want to bear left? Like, left? That's, that's good. That's good, Henry. It is a W and double tap. Easy now. That's right, stay on the path. So there's a nest near here somewhere. I don't want to dismount. I do want to get some food. Because Henry could do with some, you know? I also need to sort out all this extra gear on the horse. Also, what sort of time is it? played too many Elder Scrolls games recently, I expect the time to appear on the... Holy shit! Fucking Talmberg! Good God, Henry! Is there like an autosave? Yes, there probably is. Henry, you messed up big time. How big? Really big. So yeah, Talmberg is not Ratai. Or Rate. Wow! Well, you know... You're kind of giving those nasty men time to get ahead of you here, Henry. And that's not very clever. And this is a different road, but we might make slightly better. T no, not really. Mm, worth a try though. So Henry messed up. If you try to go left, horse. Thank you, you did not try to go left. But it would have been kind of back the way we came. all the stupidest mistakes to make. Thing is, it wasn't getting locations mixed up, it was getting place names mixed up. Alright, 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 where are we here? Yep, yeah, back to Neuhof. which may or may not have a slightly Irish sounding name. Ow. Yep, sorry! Kind of a little bit of an emergency here, as you can tell by my breakneck plodding. 
pace here. Should I have veered left there? Oh, maybe not. Okay. Right. Henry. So many fingers on the keyboard now. Ooh, okay, yeah, that works. In theory. This is the diversion I was thinking of taking. And before you pull me up on that, it genuinely is because I was thinking of cutting across here like that. Probably not wise, but we're taking the second right. Probably. No, horse, no! Thank you, horse. Not the first left. Pebbles. I know you and Henry haven't been together for very long now, but I do need you to learn to read his mind a little bit better than that, because your powers of... psychic reading are not quite what they could be, you know? Another strangely shaped bale of hay. I'm just so used to them being like, you know, round like barrels or something instead of vertical like towers. Look kind of like giant oversized insect hives or something. Now, the next turning on the right should be ours. And I don't expect Pebbles to take it, but I expect me to do so. Is this it? Coming up here? Yes, it... Maybe... No. This looks like it'll be it, though. There we go. Getting a little bit back on track now. God, fucking dogs. Again. You know, Henry should probably leave his horse here at the inn. Just ride up here and dismount. I'd love to, my lady, but I got important business to do running away from you. You sound like some kind of evil temptress, and I've got a man's life to save. And that involves running away from that bloody horse that took me all the wrong way, and it wasn't my fault, honest. As I run madly, not screaming, into the forest, I'll come back for you, Pebbles, I promise. I, I don't hate you, really. You're not as bad as the first two horses Henry tried to ride. No. Let's have a mushroom. Like that, two mushrooms. And then... Let's just try to avoid trouble. Thing is, we're going to find him, he'll talk to us, and then the fugs will turn up and it'll go all kinds of horrible, and Henry still doesn't have any new equipment. And it will all go horribly wrong, because those fugs won't be armed guards. I mean, the charcoal burners won't be armed guards. How much further have we got to go? Hey, not too far, in theory. Oh, uh. So let's just jog a little more, Henry. i tell you, the whole root bolts, that is not being a felled tree, that's fallen. And there's no hole where it came from, that's the downside, there should be... That grew back really quickly, given the state of this. Now, we've had two warnings to expect trouble.
And how do we clear blood from a sword? That's not... That's also quite intimidating, to be honest. Uh, 43, 43, 2... 35... Well, it's just better, okay. Now this sword can get blood on it as well. Hopefully not too soon, though. Because the body count is shockingly high for our adventure so far. I mean, yes, these are violent and dangerous times, but even so, the, the amount of people Henry has personally put down now is, what, two or three or something? It's still quite a... I mean, okay, so I beat that guy with my bare hands when he had a hand axe and I, I let him go. Pretty sure I defeated someone else in a fight before. Yeah, don't, don't, don't be bad. Don't be bad. Don't be bad things happening. That looks bad. That looks like someone getting crucified or something. Huh. Hello. God be with you. Do you know where I can find Ginger, a stable boy from Neuhoff? Why don't you try Neuhoff? <laughs> he was there, but now everyone says he's hiding with some charcoal burner friends of his. Uh, well, I can't help you there. I've heard nothing about him. Or him. I bet you haven't. What is this? Some kind of, um... It's like they're building a wicker man or something? No, 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 they just got different... Maybe they've just arrived and they haven't quite built their ovens up yet and they're just starting. Shh. Come in. I know something. Oh, really? Good day to you. What do you know? Oh, shit, there's a man you know something about Ginger. in uniform. I might have heard something. And if you share a bit of silver with me, I might share what I know. You know... I do have some silver. That depends. What do you want in return? A bit of silver never hurt anybody. That story about 30 pieces of silver didn't have a happy ending. <laughs> well, then it will have to be more than 30. Try convincing. Ooh. All right, I'm going to go 32. Not bad, not bad. Listen up. Ginger has two mates, twins, who are keeping him hidden and taking care of him. They go out every day to bring him something to eat. Where do they take the food? I don't know. I didn't follow them. Oh, I would God. Have. That's all you have? That's what I paid so much silver for? If you'd already known that much, you wouldn't be here talking to me. <laughs> so I reckon you got your money's worth. You didn't even tell me where the twins lived! Well, he's earned his 32 pieces of silver and I hope he's very happy with them. Henry is not. But, you know, ours not to reason why, ours but to do. Hello, you. Oh! God be with you. Ooh! So where's Ginger? I know you're hiding him, and I'm not leaving till I get an answer. Hey, that's... Who told you that? One of the charcoal burners here. Oh, my I don't God. Know what called. He was quite sure about it. You don't want to believe everything you hear. That's a load of horse shit. Really? Well, we can find out easily enough. From what I hear, you bring him food every day. So all I have to do is <laughs> wait for one of you to leave and follow him, right? Oh, fuck it. The damage is done. What do you want, then? <laughs> I want to find Ginger and ask him about that raid. But Ginger ain't safe as long as those two cutthroats are lurking around. So, if you want to talk to him, better deal with them first. Unless you're one of the gang too. Well, if I am, you just said something really dumb. Um, oh god. Okay. Alright, I'll deal with them. And then you'll tell me where you've got Ginger hidden, right? Right. You get rid of them, and I'll tell you. 
So where can I find these bandits? I'm not sure exactly. There's lots of places to hide around here. But they came and went over the bridge, so I reckon they must be somewhere between here and our neighbours. That's a lot of woods to comb through. Not all that much. There's a path around there somewhere leading to an abandoned camp. You know, Henry, how far to Talmberg? Not far. I'm liking this idea. It also involves not going back for pebbles just yet. A horse will attract attention. And apparently, I can recover things from it really easily, which is very disturbing. What am I currently carrying? Okay. Okay. Yeah, I'd better go back to the horse. Hmm. Or I just go to Talmberg, buy some better equipment because I've got plenty of money. Maybe even get a place to rest. Now what's this? This is... Oh, this is dubious. Probably shouldn't eat that. I'm hoping there's not a time limit on this. There probably is. Oh, bloody hell. It's so close! Damn it, Henry, why did you have to get a conscience? It's so close, but looks too far. If there is a quest failed state on this one for leaving it too long, I reckon going about halfway to Talmberg from here would do it. Hello, you. Oi. You. Oh, you're a charcoal burner, okay. Well, alright, I won't rugby tackle you to the ground, Ben. Mostly because Henry doesn't know what rugby is. Oh, I go to somewhere. <laughs> Buy and sell things. Want to go to Ujits and learn how to read and write and understand the magic of letters. It's a really wonderful skill. Bloody hell, Henry, that was close. He climbed over a bush and fell off the bush. Don't know how you do it. But do it, you do. To I really hope I can just scare these guys off instead of fighting them because Fighting them two on one. Well, we know how that worked out last time. That really looked like a man standing in the middle of the path there with the bush behind it. Actually, oh, bloody hell, Henry. But Henry's hurt his legs, apparently. Injured right leg, injured left leg. Yeah, that's not good. And we're safely out of the bubble. Interesting.
Ooh. This looks like a campsite and a half. Not going to steal that. This looks like the kind of place a poacher might keep his. Hey! Okay. Okay. Henry's not good enough to use this bow yet. Didn't rise over requirements on it. Best check this. Oh god, minimum agility 5. Alright, Henry. Minimum agility 3. And we have agility 3. Okay. Good to know. And put that bow away, Henry. You'll frighten the dear little rabbit. God, Henry. You just shot that straight into the ground, didn't you? Hey. Don't mind me. Yeah, that didn't even remotely hit the mark, did it? So I suppose I could pretend I'm hunting. If anyone asks what I'm doing here. Don't really need a helmet to go hunting, though. Or a male coif. I mean, the, the padded coif is bad enough. Easy now. Oh, out for bubble. Okay. I really need to get back to somewhere where I can safely stow that golden egg. Because it's very precious. And Henry wouldn't want to lose it or accidentally consume it. Not out here in the wilderness. I mean, it's not very nourishing for starters. Somewhere. Out here in the forest lurk two nasty thugs, two rather vicious individuals that Henry must deal with, one way or another. Now, is this sword still bloody? Yes it is, dear God, Henry. Don't you know to clean a blade? Looks like there's a clearing down this way. At least according to the map. I oh, know according to the map I'm practically in it. Well okay then. I'm bl oh shit. Right. Hey you. Greetings, my good man. May I ask you a question? Ask first, then I'll ask you something. <laughs> really? Good then. We're looking for Ginger, a stable boy uh -oh. at a nearby stud farm. Have you seen him anywhere? Oh. Um. I was just about to ask you two the same thing. <laughs> I'm looking for him too. Then it's a pity neither of us has found him yet. Thank heavens I've found you though. I imagine you two might be able to tell me something about Neuhoff. Hmm? I see. Uh oh. Well, we can give you a little demonstration of what happened there. Oh, bugger, Henry, you twat. Don't weak at the knees, have you? Not your <laughs> God. <laughs> yeah, fucking great, you bastard. <laughs> have it. Oh, fucking hell, Henry! Miss, come 
Oh, bloody hell. And dead. Great. So, literally cannot be done. Again. Brilliant. I mean, all the way back somewhere horrible, isn't it? Probably on a bloody horse. Come back, pebbles, all is forgiven. Nope. It's hit. There's no need to run away from me like that. Oh, shit. See you here again. You'll get it. Oh shit! He's probably run off to warn him now. I wouldn't be surprised if he had as well. That'd be why I saw him running off earlier. Hey you! I'm gonna, I'm gonna run up and f you. Um, sorry. All right. So at least in this instant, Henry doesn't have injured legs. But I'm kind of thinking... Go to Talmberg. You know. I'm also thinking I shouldn't have knocked that bloke over. Because he's not going to like it. But it's time to try. Thing is, if I go to Talmberg, who is there to trade with? There's that scrawny bloke. Am I better off? Going all the way back to Ratai. To resupply. Because I really need to, you know what, stuff it. really need to make a decision here. Okay, Henry needs to sleep, to eat. He certainly needs to repair his equipment. And he has to go find pebbles. Oh god, speech four. How sleepy is Henry? Yeah, he's sleepy. Not a good time to fight. Oh yeah, and you saw Perk, which I'm not going to be able to work out how to do at all. Great. Well, in that case, given how knackered Henry is, it would be reasonable to assume that the uh, the other two thugs also need to rest from time to time. And so, Henry might have an opportunity to finally... Oh, but that sense of honour... Of... No, he's knackered, come on. At least get some rest. Henry, I know you're a driven individual, but this is getting a bit bonkers. And you need to seriously bear east a bit.
if you're going to get that horse back. There's got to be a... I'm going to be... I'm going to be really dumb here and try something stupid. Like, really stupid. The kind of stupid that could get Henry killed. I'm going to walk up to those two fellows and I'm going to not let on. Okay? I I mean, I, I let them know I was looking for the same lad because I, I wanted to say I'd seen him somewhere else. Is that a voice? But I'm going to say I haven't seen... I need to give him the impression he's not here. And while I was going to try and tell them he was somewhere else, giving them the impression he was not here might be all I need to do. It might also be incredibly difficult to do. But I'll try. And I look tired and knackered, so... Oh shit, actually. Yeah. Henry's really tired. That's not good, is it? Well, I can try. Badly. I should be checking making sure that Henry's equipped with weapons he can actually use. Greetings, my good man. May I ask you a question? Ask first, then I'll ask you something. Really? Good. Hmm. We're looking for Ginger, a stable boy at a nearby stud farm. Have you seen him anywhere? He's not going to believe me, but I'll try. I don't try. know anyone called that. I'm not even from this part of the country. What a shame. We're worried about him, but we can't seem to find him. Truly, I haven't seen him. If I were you, I'd ask the charcoal burners. Uh-oh. Oh, definitely. Thank you for your <laughs> advice. Wow. That. Uh, what are you doing here? Are you after something? Um. No. See, what I'm going to do is just walk up behind your mate here and kill him with a sword. Bring it on. Well, I wanted to try. Did I get... <sighs> oh, I need to... Fuck me. Yeah, that's not good, Henry. You're dead. What the... Bloody hell are you getting a bow out for? That's no good. Oh, right. So bizarrely, it appears I have to fight them. Great. Well, that's going to have to happen in a future episode, I'm afraid. Yeah. Well, I hope you all enjoyed this one. Bloody and brutal as ever. And I'll see you all in the next one. I'll say bye-bye for now, and cheerio!